Hello and welcome. This is my first weekly favorites video. I decided to do this kind of very short and quick weekly favorites on Fridays, so I'll hope you enjoy this video. But let's get now into the product. First one is a powder, which is a surprise to me because I have dry skin and I tend to avoid powders. But this Physicians Formula Mineral Whale Loose Powder. This is a translucent powder and it surely is translucent, at least on my skin. It just mattifies, but it is invisible. I cannot, when I apply it, I cannot see it. I can use it even on my dry under eye area, on my T-zone of course, to set my cheeks and nothing looks dry or nothing is dry looking after five hours or eight hours. This is unbelievable. I've never seen powder like this. It's actually quite close to the hourglass uh, veil something, the loose powder. Um, love it. If you, if you want to have very finely milled invisible powder, definitely try this one. The second favorite is a foundation which I fell back in love because of that powder and also the combination of these products and this is the Smashbox uh, stick foundation. There is foundation in one end and contour shade in other end. This is a very emollient product, so not for oily skin. This is great for dry combination, mature skin. Light to medium coverage applies very evenly, lasts surprisingly long time and well. And with combination, using that powder with this one, uh, it, it's, it, it is beautiful on skin, very natural skin-like finish, which lasts for hours. So. I'm, I'm happy with this. The third product is Corenta Organics or Cosmetics. I never remember which way, but it is a Finnish brand and this is their new Rose Quartz Highlighter. It has a pinkish shade uh, leaning to a little bit of kind of purplish gray silvery hue. Um, it is a cream highlighter and it gives you this kind of wet look. I have it today, so not uh, no glitters, no shimmers, it's not a blinding highlight, it's this kind of natural glow, wet looking highlight. This is very kind of creamy, almost um, oil, oily feeling, it's not oily but it's very very uh, emollient as well, so especially if you have dry skin as I do, you might really love this. Again for oily skin, not possibly the best one, but maybe with setting powder might work. But definitely worth a try and this is clean beauty. Here were my three weekly favorites this week. I hope you enjoyed this new form format. If you did, leave me a thumbs up so I will know. And now I wish you have a great weekend and see you next time. Bye bye.